currency exchange across time congratulations the year is 2030 and after a few months of waiting on a list you've been chosen to become one of a select few individuals who will be allowed to time travel to your chosen year of 1890. As you don't want to be left empty-handed, you've chosen to take with you about $10,000 in 2030 United States dollars around $7,800 in 2020 United States dollars with an inflation rate of 2.5%. According to some quick searches, $10,000 in 1890 would be closer to $363,000 in 2030, given the 2.5% inflation rate. However, the currency in 1890 is physically very different from the modern dollar bill, as the modern Federal Reserve was only even founded in 1913. As such, you'll have to find a way to turn your $10,000 in modern bills into a similar face value in 1890 in order to multiply your purchasing power. Some other details. Assume that the bills in 2030 are the same ones being used by the USA in 2020. You can make multiple jumps to different time periods, however because of the amount of power required, each additional jump to a different time will cost you about $500 in advance. You can however control when you choose to make each jump without needing to schedule a time. You are allowed to exchange your money for other goods, but the time traveling system will only allow you to bring along a large backpack of items. You can make multiple trips it will cost you the price of extra jumps. You can go forwards in time as well as backwards but you can't travel into the future past 2030. You're only able to time travel, not teleport. This means that when you jump through time you'll end up in about the same place you started. This means you must be able to walk wherever you need to get to or pay someone to take you there. Your starting place is the middle of Chicago. You cannot get caught exchanging new currency that was printed in the future for older currency such as trading a $2,030 bill for a $2,005 bill. You can do it, you just can't get caught. There's no magic technology in 2030 that can convert your $10,000 into a face value of $10,000 in 1890 bills. I'm not sure what what plot points you want to make in your story. There's no magic technology in 2030 that can convert your 10,000 into a face value of 10,000 in 1890 bills. There is no magic, but there is technology. The facility providing the time travel service will have counterfeit currency for the decades of interest for the various destinations making use of craftsmen experienced in engraving plates for paper currency, knowledge of paper and coin alloys, and computer printing technology. Paper currency isn't that old, and coins would be primary. Previous time travelers will have returned with real currency after trading it with valuable metals. The Chrono Agency could provide all the way from gold coins down to cowrie shell currency. You mentioned, this means you must be able to walk wherever you need to get to or pay someone to take you there. Gold dust, flakes, and nuggets in various sizes will translate into almost any language in any time period. Beads, jewelry, fire starting kits, and clothing could be used for trade with tribal communities.